Learning construction. Learn, share, expand. Hey guys, so for this video, we're gonna fix a leak that we have in this trailer over here. Uh, yesterday we found that we have a leak from the water pipe that's on this section over here. That part of the dog thing is that they are under the shower. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna teach you guys how to fix it without having to uh, take the shower. And for this repair, okay, we're gonna so be we're needing to fish the line, a T, and couplings. Just this pipe over here, except for the and they won't quite come out where I want it to. That's not a big deal. Okay. And now, we're gonna take some pipe, we're gonna take it inside of here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna connect a coupling from here to here to a new pipe. This couplings here have a pressure bushing. I'm going to show you. Have these pressure bushings over here that basically trap the pipe with this metal o ring that you see over here. Um, and then it has a rubber bushing on the inside. So once you put pressure on the washer, like I did on this one over here, it secures the pipe and it seals with this pipe. So. One of the things that you are going to want to do is, you don't need to take this off, you just want to leave it, you just want to leave it slightly loose, like this. And before you put the next pipe, before you put the pipe in there, you want to use some soap to lubricate the pipe and then insert it in. Now the pipe is very important that when you cut it, that it's completely straight on one end and it slips right inside of this guy and it has to be about an so, inch and a quarter that it's gonna get in place. So, the other video we saw it, where it the leak was coming from. All the way in, otherwise it's not gonna see and it. now that we identify that is the cold water line, we're going to chase it. This is the other side of the tub, right here. And so it's gonna be this pipe over here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna cut it on this side of the pipe over here so we can add the other coupling. You don't want to cut too close to this one though, so we're going to try to utilize as much, probably put it on this side over here, which is going to be kind of tough. Okay, so this pipe over here is the perfect example of what not to do. You see how this pipe over here is an angle? That's not good. You want this pipe to be straight. So you make your cut, then they sell tools for this.